Well, no dairy event in the world compares to the one happening in Madison this week. More than 70,000 people from 100 different countries are here for World Dairy Expo. And where else would you expect to find the fabulous Farm Bay? Pam Yonke joins us live from the Alliance Energy Center. Pam, take it away. Congratulations. Oh, my goodness. You wish I could take it away. I all of a sudden have so much more activity around me than I expected, like, literally 30 seconds ago. That's good. That's good. Set her up. Set her up. You can't do World Dairy Expo without a cow. Thank you to Tina McG McG McDonald for the, I know it's filter. I got to have a Guernsey. I got to have something bovine behind me. Uh, what we're doing is tonight we're celebrating some of the leaders of the industry. So our Dairy Person of the Year and our Dairy Farmer of the Year are here from Wisconsin. Shelly Myers, our Dairy Industry Person of the Year. John Rudiger from Van Dyne is our Dairyman of the Year. And I wanted to make sure that we highlighted Wisconsin. And John got a little bit lost. That's why I'm winded, he's winded. Shelly is the leader of the professional dairy producers of Wisconsin, as well as being a dairy producer herself in Slinger. How long have you been executive director of PDPW? 30 years. I started when I was 10. <laughs> this, congratulations, though, to you both. You both have been real leaders. You said all day you've kind of been on pins and needles about this. Pins and needles, it just feels weird. It feels like... Um, I don't know, like that kid that was in the right place and gets a, a blue ribbon for showing someone else's cow because this award really goes to the leaders, like John, of, of professional dairy producers. Tell people a little bit on how you've seen not only the show change, grow, but even the dairy industry in Wisconsin. Oh boy, the first time I was at this show, I was probably on the shoulders of my dad. We'd yeah, walk around. Right. So they, it's changed so much. I mean, there's a lot of things about the dairy industry that um, dairy community, we really are a community yes. of a bunch of farm families that are, are bringing the best product out there, milk to them. But um, when you look at the size of the equipment, the farms, there's about the same amount of cows in Wisconsin and across the country as there used to be, but our cows are so much more efficient. We've learned how to be more effective and efficient with all of our resources, less water used to produce a gallon of milk. Um, I think that there's a lot of things that remain the same though, and that is the goodness of the people. Uh, the people that I work with are always trying to learn. The young people that we're working with are asking the same questions that we asked probably 25 years <laughs> ago, and that is, true. I want to be a part of it. How can I do this? What mm -hmm. do I have to do to be successful? Okay. But yeah. uh, so many things have changed. Well, we're, like I said, I wanted to put the highlight on Wisconsin because tonight these two are going to be center of the rink. Excuse me, sweetness, let me get in here. <laughs> John uh, Rudinger is a dairy producer from Van Dyne. And you were saying if you weren't being recognized tonight, you'd still be coming to the show. Oh, yeah. Every year you have to come to the show. Here, face, oh, your lovely hey, face forgot out. what we're doing, huh? <laughs> no, every year you have to come to the World Dairy Expo to see the greatness that this industry really has to offer, Pam. It's, it's phenomenal when you look at it. The number of people that are excited about being in and agriculture, especially dairy, is really phenomenal. And uh, tell us a little bit about your farm. Well, we uh, dairy in the Fond du Lac uh, area, 1,500 cows. We're the third generation going to the fourth generation dairy producer. And as Shelly stated, as Keep Shelley going. stated earlier, uh, you know, uh, working working within the industry is really cool, and allowing and having another generation come to take over a family farm is truly remarkable, and, and it's a great, great thing. Proud of you for doing it. Now we've got a visual here. Tell me, tell me what we got here. This is nutter butter. Uh, nutter butter. Nice. From Wisconsin, New Glarus. Hello, nutter butter, you sweetie baby. This is what Pam's supposed to be doing. This is nutter butter. <laughs> Tell me how jealous you are. I Tell me how jealous. jealous you are of this. I am very <laughs> jealous. I live a good life. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you, Nutter Butter. Pam, I used thank to do you. this thank as a kid, believe it or not. Thank you, Pam. Thanks, thanks you, your guest for us, please. And the Nutter Butter. <laughs> Nutter Butter.